This is group two. Madison, Selena, and I, Bob, will be presenting to the local stuff. Hello, fellows. What a lovely day today. Absolutely glorious. There's no place on earth like the sun drenched beaches of the weaker resort. Trust me, only a few people like you are lucky enough to have such a wonderful climate. I feel painful whenever I call back, waking up exhausted on mornings with a burning fireball appetite back to where I come from. So let's not waste this blessing. Well, first of all, I would like to thank you all for coming to this meeting or sharing, I should say. My name is Patrick Doubt, and I come from New York. I believe that some of you have already met me and may be wondering, like, what's this guy doing here? Uh, he doesn't seem to, sharing, to be sharing any of our duties, but meeting managers all the time. But let me solve your puzzle. Today, I'm going to share with you my experience and observations in the past two weeks, and also some of my suggestions on how to make you feel that Weaker is a wonderful place to work at. Well, let me thank you again on, uh, on behalf of managers for all the uh, great work and effort you contributed in the past few years. It is you that have made this resort a great place. In the past few weeks, it has been a really pleasant stay here, during which I think there's something we could do even better. The level of interaction, active interaction between you and expatriate managers are not that high. And this is surprising that generally in other resorts I've been working with, managers are more, are more like friends to staff in the free time. And if staff have any problem or doubt, they wouldn't bother share, uh, coming straight to the manager for advice. But interestingly here, since the managers mostly come from outside the British Virgin Island, their working style is quite different from what it, what it is here. And I agree that some of their leadership style is inappropriate. And I will talk to them as well. But I can't deny that we can make this resort an even better place, even if you love the job just a little bit more and truly pay attention to the manager's advice. It's okay if you don't understand them or disagree with their approach, but why not share your thoughts with them so that they can understand your needs and tailor the most appropriate solution that you would feel most comfortable with? Win-win situation. The solution that uh, the property manager, uh, Mawini, is doing a great job. He noticed that mammals won't do enough, so he switched to doing a physical uh, demonstration himself to make sure the staff are clear of the responsibility they're, ex they're expected to have. Well, honestly, I'm really jealous of the local government protecting, protecting your job, because back in the United States, if we, want to work, uh, if we want to live a good life, we need to fight for it. And that's why managers here always looked anxious and wanted to connect with you to make this resort a better place. They just can't adapt to the low paced life here. It is true that they shouldn't shout at you. I mean, I feel bad if someone shouts at me too, but if you could, if you could listen to what they said, I promise the shouts will turn into a compliment. For example, if staff back in the kitchen could have told Lucas that the ingredients are missing, he won't be angry at all. In which case you're happy, guest is happy, manager is happy, and turnover will be low that they won't come and go that often. And I will talk to the boss that they should uh, hire more staff during the peak season. So don't worry about having less time with your family, but please do call the manager if you feel that only your effort won't be enough to cope with the incoming guests. My name is Madison, the co-worker of Patrick. So it's about halfway through our presentation and I'd like to take some time to talk about some other stuff. During my chit chats with some of you guys, a few of you have reflected on the fact that you're sometimes feeling kind of confused during work. I believe that not only those of you who told me about your thoughts, but almost everyone here had experienced having some questions popping up in your head when you're working. Like, which part of the work had I done the most well? How am I supposed to improve? Or I worked extra hard this time. Am I going to get any credits for what I've done? Something like that. We all get demotivated somehow when we don't clearly know what we want to pursue or when we don't know in what ways our hard work pays off. And I believe that no one doesn't like getting appreciated for what we've done as a team or as an individual contributor. So right now, I'd like to introduce you all to a whole new evaluation and reward system, which is a plan we devised to ensure fairness and operational transparency in the result so that everyone here can get what you deserve. Let me first talk about the evaluation system. The plan is to, is to have everyone's performance evaluated according to a fixed set of criteria. Evaluation will be made every once a half year in three main ways, which is through managers, peers, and customers. 
Some of you may have queries about the weighting each of these three, these three counts, but don't worry. The evaluation plan has considered your job position in the result for staff who work at the front line, meaning those of you who have let chances to come in touch with customers. 60% will be based on managers, 20% will be based on customers, and 20% will be based on peer evaluation. As for staffs who work at the backstage, including maintenance staffs and those of you who doesn't need to interact with customers face-to-face, 70% -face, counts for managers' evaluation, and 30% will be based on peer evaluation. You may wonder how specifically are performance to be measured, and like what I just mentioned, Managers will evaluate everything according to a clear and transparent set of criteria, which is separated into different categories. For example, work effectiveness, efficiency, quality of work, working attitude, etc. Different departments will be evaluated with criteria in a way that is most compatible. The details of the plan will be announced later by the managers. By then, you will receive all information about the evaluation plan with clear description on how each category of work is assessed. There will also be a similar system for evaluating the manager's performances, which provides you all with a platform to give comments in a fair way. The details for this will also be announced later, though, as the plan is still under construction. So allow me to first thank you all for your patience. For the peer evaluation part, you all be invited to fill in questionnaires regarding how you feel about each other's work. It will be conducted in an anonymous way so as to ensure the contents of your, of your reviews are well protected. As for customer evaluation, customers will be invited to fill in surveys to give detailed description on how they feel about their state in the result so that these comments will also be included in the evaluation. Now I'll move on to talk about the reward system which is set up based on this evaluation plan after you have all received your evaluation report, those of you who got high rankings in each category of evaluation will be given a chance to choose a reward. Some of the rewards include increasing the number of days of your annual leave, getting prizes such as flight tickets for you to go on trips, or tickets to all kinds of activities and events. You must even get a ticket to a real-time football match of your favorite team. The rewards also include allowing your family members to have long stays at the resorts for free, and many more that I'm not going to list out here. I hope this sounds really attractive to you guys, because this is really attractive to me though. The objective of this reward system is to distribute bonuses more evenly throughout all staff members, so that a friendlier and better working environment can be created for all of you. For this, we hope everyone's hard work can be appreciated, and we can all spend some pleasant time working here at the resort. So now let me pass the time to Selena. So I'm Selena, and upon the reward and evaluation system that is explained by Madison, there will also be a mentor program for all of you to minimize your worries and confusions during work. Knowing that some of you sometimes feel kind of confused, apart from receiving evaluation results directly, we would also like to provide chances for you to seek advice on your difficulties from work, so that all of you could work more confidently. Let me explain how the mentor program works. First of all, each of you will have a senior staff of your department assigned as your mentor, including backstage staff. Then you and your mentor would have a monthly meetup to update each other's situation. The meetup will be in a more relaxing way like lunch or dinners. We hope that in this way, you and your mentor could have a more comfortable and friendly conversation. You will be able to hear sharings and advice from your mentors on how to handle different work work situations or how they improve their abilities in their past experiences. And this will also provide the platform for you to share about your worries and questions about work. We understand that some of you might be shy or feel embarrassed to meet and discuss work with senior staff or even not having any difficulties in work. Well, we know that many of you are going, doing a good job, right? Therefore, you can just treat this meetup as time to make friends with your mentor. You guys do not necessarily talk about work, and you can share difficulties or worries even from daily life, family, or friends, or even chit chat. All in you know, all, it is a platform for all of you to eliminate your confusions if you have one, so that you can work more confidently and, most importantly, have more reliable friends and close bondings in your working place, so that you can all could work more happily. On the other hand, coming to the last part, which is also the most exciting part, there will be regular free parties for all of you to celebrate your hard work. These parties will be held once in two months, involving colleagues within your whole department. Also paying hard work, there isn't any better thing than celebrating with your team and the colleagues that you work with, right? 
All staffs will take turns designing a restaurant or meeting place of the party for the department with the budget set by the company, as well as organizing neat games and activities or set a dress code if you want. You can relieve stress and enjoy a fun time with your teammates with fun games and good food. It is also a good time where you can get to know each other more. You know, you might not have many chances to talk to every teammate during work, even that you guys meet every day. We hope to we hope that through getting closer to each other, you all could have a more harmonious working place with closer bondings and relationships with your team. That's it. These are all the new systems and programs that are going to, to be rolled out. Reward system, mentor program, and regular free parties. Don't they sound interesting and exciting? With these new systems and programs to eliminate your confusions and enhance team building, let's build a cheerful and motivating working environment. We should all approach work in a happier and more enjoyable way and be more professional at the same time. Thank you. All right. So I'll stop recording. <laughs>